Canada Day celebrations came to a tragic end yesterday. Two men were stabbed outside the Forks during the fireworks display. And as CTV's Raheem Lathani explains, the incident has left many second-guessing their safety. Tragedy marked Canada Day celebrations at the Forks. While people gathered nearby for fireworks, police converged at Main and Broadway for a stabbing that turned fatal, the city's 12th homicide this year. It's a little bit shocking. This family was celebrating at the Forks at the same time the stabbings took place. I don't really expect something like that to happen. Police say officers across the street saw an altercation break out here between two groups. By the time the officers crossed the street, the groups had taken off on foot, leaving behind two men with stab wounds. We had officers plainly visible, you know, a short distance away. And unfortunately, this, uh, this type of violence can occur. CTV has learned the victims were walking home from the forks when jumped by a group of eight men. One man died. His brother-in-law, 23-year-old Matthew Behrens, remains in hospital with a collapsed lung. Scared. Doesn't know what to think. And we cried together as soon as I walked into his room. Even though there were thousands of people at the forts, visitors now plan to be more cautious. You know, it's disappointing. You know, spoils Canada Day. And it certainly makes people think twice about coming down here with their kids. I think we'll still keep coming. We come here every year. We'll just maybe not wander off, just kind of stick with the crowd. Police still don't have any suspects in custody. Raheem Ladhani, CTV News, Winnipeg.